Hello students, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, we are going to see how to calculate the area of path. Okay, so these are very useful to solve the problems in exercise 11.2 of class 7. See here, it is a square, right? Inside also one square is there. Now, this is the path. Okay, so this is the path. So, how to calculate the area of this path means area of outer square minus area of this inner square. Similarly, here also in this rectangle, area of outer rectangle minus area of this inner rectangle will give us the area of this path. Okay, students, what is if the path is like this? What is the area of the path? If it is a square, then it is area of outer square minus area of inner square. If it is a rectangle, area of outer rectangle minus area of inner rectangle. So, area of square path equals to area of outer square ABCD is minus area of inner square E of GH. Okay. Similarly, here also you can write like this. Area of rectangular path, area of outer rectangle ABCD minus area of inner rectangle E of GH. Students, I think this is very clear. Now, if the path is outside the square, okay, then, so here, if the path is outside, that means inside Inside square side is given. And then, local vipuna square side maniki telisina pudu and path width telisina pudu. Then, how to calculate outer side square side? Okay. E by down square side and edi manamela find out chest. We know this side. Okay. And width telisu maniki. Okay. Ikada width manam calculate chest at a pudu. It rendu vipula on to nikada. So, if the path is outside, then outer side, outer square side, ela ostundi vaniki ante, inner, inner square side plus 2 into width. Okay. So, two sides on tundi kada. So, 2 into width. Outer square side. So, simply, S is equals to S plus 2W also you can write. Now, if the path is inside the square, that means we know the outer side, outer square side and we want to calculate this. Now, minus chayali kada idi. So, inner square side, if the path is inside the square, inner square side is these are very useful in solving problems. Inner square side is outer square side minus 2 into width. Okay. So, these, these three are the main points here to remember. Similarly, in the rectangular case also, if the path is outside, outside, then new length will be length plus 2 into width okay and breadth also b plus 2 into width if the path is inside the rectangle so inside the rectangle that means if we know the outer length if we want we want to calculate the inner rectangle length then l is equals to l minus 2w b is equals to b minus 2w so, this is the confusion. If the path is outside the rectangle, means the inner side of the rectangle length the outer side rectangle is find out. We add two, two times of width. Add. Okay, na? If the path is inside, we big rectangle. 
స్మాల్ రెక్టాంగిల్ని కనుక్కోవాలి అంటే బిగ్ రెక్టాంగిల్ లెంత్ నుంచి ఈ విడ్త్ అనేది మనం సబ్ట్రాక్షన్ చేయాలి పిల్లలు ఓకేనా నెక్స్ట్ ఇఫ్ ద పాత్ ఈజ్ లైక్ దిస్ నావ్ హౌ డూ యూ క్యాల్కులేట్ ద ఏరియా ఆఫ్ ద పాత్ సో నావ్ హియర్ ఇన్ దిస్ కేస్ ఏరియా ఆఫ్ ద పాత్ ఈజ్ ఈక్వల్స్ టు హియర్ వన్ రెక్టాంగిల్ ఈజ్ దేర్ నా ఏబిసిటి and it is also one rectangle e f g h and in between there is a square right so area of these two rectangles minus area of the square how we will get the area of the path here in this case if the path is like this now area of rectangle a b c d plus area of rectangle e of g h minus area of square if we name it as k l m n okay like this you can calculate if the path is like this okay similarly in the case of rectangle also here area of the path same area of path is equals to so here also same you can write area of rectangle abcd plus area of rectangle e of g h minus area of square so enduku manam idi subtraction cheyali ante common ga vachindi kada so ee rectangle lo vachindi ee rectangle lo two times vachindi right so that's why we are subtracting here okay now here area of rectangle formula length into breadth na so the length of this rectangle will be this length only and this length breadth okay and width width of the path they will give in the problem and here also length of this rectangle is side of the square okay and length of this rectangle side of the square width will be given in the problem so now with the compass we will draw circle right so like this we will draw circle so where we kept the compass tip is called center of the circle okay circle is nothing but the collection of all the points from a fixed point okay so this is called center of the circle okay and if we join any two points on the circle then it is called chord of the circle what is this chord of the circle okay now distance from center to the circle is called radius what is the distance from center to the circle radius it will be represented by small r now the line joining and the line joining two points on the circle is called chord na so the chord which passes through the center is called diameter what is this diameter and half in the diameter from center to circle is r na so diameter is equals to r plus r that means diameter is two times of radius in other words radius is half in the diameter so these both points will be used in the problems okay now this is a radius and this is a radius now this part is called a sector what is this sector okay so these are the main basics of the circle so here this this length of the circle is called circumference what is the length of the circle students circumference of the circle so that is 2 pi r here pi is equals to 22 by 7 and the area inside the circle is pi r square what is the formula for area of the circle pi r square 
So now here one small circle is there and one big circle is there. Okay. So between the small and big circle, the white part is called the path of the circle. What is this? Path. Okay. How do you calculate the path of the this circular path area? Means outer circle area minus inner circle area. Okay. So if outer circle radius, outer circle radius is capital R, inner circle radius small r. Definitely inner circle radius is less than outer circle radius. Na? So small r. Now area of circular path, area of circular path a is equals to area of outer circle area of outer circle minus area of inner circle okay so in other words we can write area of circular path is equals to area of outer circle what is the formula what is the radius of outer circle capital R? So pi capital R square minus area of inner circle pi small r square. Now pi is common in both the both terms. So take it out. So remaining capital R square minus small r square. Now students it is in the form of a square minus b square. So what is the formula of a square minus b square means a plus b into a minus b or a minus b into a plus b also. So we can write this capital R square minus small r square based on this algebraic identity. Capital R plus small r into capital R minus small r. So sometimes it is difficult to calculate square values, right? For big values. So in that case, you can solve like this. Okay. Students, this is... Uh, about the area of paths in squares and, and rectangle and in circular model. Okay. Students, please like this video and please share with your friends and please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.